That's another planet we'll never be able to visit again. Because you tried to steal their most priceless artifact. How's I supposed to know that thing was so important to him? There was a plaque right next to it that said so. Yeah, well, I don't go to museums to read. I go there to steal. Anyone else would have waited to offend their clients until after they were paid. I'm not anyone else. I'm one of a kind, baby. A fact that makes me wonder how much a museum might pay for you. I am Groot. Oh, don't you side with them, you overgrown... What trouble have you steered us into now, Quill? Nothing. There's literally nothing out here. My scanners are coming up blank. I have never heard this alarm before. It is a horrid sound. I am Groot. True. Anything is better than that racket Star-Lord calls music. Rocket, any idea why our ship is on the fritz? I might have installed a new scanner I whipped up that detects high concentrations of unusual energy. Cosmic cubes, negapans, Asgardian hammers. You know, the kind of stuff people pay big money for. But there's nothing out here but rocks. If I were hiding an object of immense cosmic power, I would want it to look that way as well. Can you lead us to it? Can I? Psh, bet your hair is pink, but I can. Whatever it is, it should be right behind this. I am Groot. You can say that again. This is a Hala-class Kree warship. These vessels usually carry hundreds of soldiers. But there's not a single sign of life on board. Something's not right here. We need to take a look around, see if we can find... Treasure. I was going to say any survivors, but... Sure, treasure's always good too. Seriously? No welcoming committee? Scans were right. We've got ourselves a ghost ship. Why would the crew abandon a vessel of this caliber? I have a terrible feeling we are about to find out. on these poor, unsuspecting crates? Good. Moving on. Hold on. <laughs> Some weird energy readings just popped up on my map. Over there. Such a shiny switch is begging to be flipped. We'd better clear this junk out of the way. <laughs> Behind door number two. There's only one way out. 
falling apart. Try to jump over the gaps. Easy to say for the man with the ridiculous boot jets. I knew I should have stayed on the ship. Hold your fire. For now. You. You certainly weren't who we were expecting. But we will be more than glad to kill you anyway. <laughs> you couldn't mind your business, sister. Your presence here may have exposed us all. For that, you must pay. These Creed coons ain't going down easy. Don't just fight. Fight smart. Block her attacks. Of every being in this universe will be on your hands, Guardians. So I will gladly have your blood on mine. Warm up, Soldier King. Time to bring out the big guns. <laughs> I still hate this lady. Level up. Idiots. Your stupidity may have doomed the universe. Wouldn't be the first time, sweetheart. Whatever the Kree are hiding on this ship, it must be very important if Nebula is involved. But if their trap was not meant for us, then who was it for? Anyone else kind of hope we never have to find out? <laughs>
energy source we're tracking should be right past whatever the heck that thing is. <laughs> Level up! <laughs> These ones think they are tough. How amusing. Smash the core computer and the barrier should go down. Bombs? All right. Now things are getting fun. What can you let us into now? Danger and chaos. Two of my favorite things. That's over. Don't get too comfy, pal. Final destination's right on the other side of this door. Proven far more resourceful than I would have imagined. But the time has come to face your final judgment. Muscles! The Kree were trying to save all of time and space from being ripped asunder. But you Guardians had to barge in and expose us all to those who will ultimately bring our destruction. Not to say. That totally does sound like something we would do. Oh, watch out for that one. Couldn't even block it. At least for you. What the fruit tank was that? It's too late. The Kree sacrificed thousands of brave souls to gather the only artifacts capable of holding off the forces of oblivion. And this, it seems. It shall be our last step. Perhaps this is all a misunderstanding. If we could stop fighting for just a minute, we might be able to find a way to fix this. The damage is already done. Our location has been discovered. There is only enough time left to die with honor. And I will make certain that you go first. Whoever you're afraid of, Roman, we can help you fight them. He's clearly not a team player, Gamora. Let's show him what he's missing. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. 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 O
They have arrived. They? Who is they? What is this all about, Ronin? This is about the end of all that is. And we are the ones who shall deliver it. Once you have returned to us what is ours, Cree Dog. Never. That madman you obey only wishes to destroy. The time has come to return home. Your master awaits. The Infinity Stones. Rocket, do you see this? All six. Rocket? Rocket? So, here's the way I see it. I know you said these stones belong to your master, whoever that is, but technically, we got here first. So how's about you take three, we take three, and we call it a... Hey! You will leave here with nothing, not even your lives. <laughs> worlds. Your pathetic attacks cannot harm me. We weren't trying to hurt you, just to distract you. Distract? No! You shall not have them. I swear in Thanos' name! Did she say Thanos? <laughs> Quill, you can't let her have them! <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gonna hurl. Oh, great. You're here. Oh, I thought we were dead. We aren't dead, are we? I have felt death. This is slightly less pleasant. We are alive, but we could be anywhere in space or time. The Infinity Stones are not playthings. Hey, I did exactly what you said. I saved the items of insane cosmic power from the Psycho Space Lady. I am Groot. You can? And you just sat there listening to us jabber? Do it already! Oh, great. We saved the universe from disaster. But we're the ones that end up in prison? Yep, that sounds about right. Why were we transported to this place, Quill? I, I don't know. I just grabbed the stone and thought of somewhere safe. Yeah, well, something tells me we'd be a lot safer on the other side of that flarkin' door. <laughs> 